All right, another beautiful day here in Minnesota. It is September 18th, and I am out today foraging for Heresium corylites, also known as the comb tooth fungus. Um, fantastic eating mushroom. They grow on hardwood trees like maple, uh, beechwood, oak. Often you find them, you know, on the ground. I honestly have only found two in my entire life. Um, I think they're amazingly good eating mushrooms, fungus, whatever. And I think it's time that I go and actually try to find some. I spent a lot of hours walking through the woods looking for them. Or looking for mushrooms. You'd think I'd run, or run over a few of them someplace. But I'm out. And um, a lot of maple trees. You know, I don't see a lot of downed dead ones. But anyway, we're going to look. We're going to look hard. So hopefully we'll find some. Well, we didn't make it too far. And you can see there are some right here. There it is. That's comb tooth fungus. Heresium corylites. A couple of really little ones. And one maybe the size of a baseball. And, you know, I'm not positive, but here's going to be some bonus mushrooms over here. I'm pretty sure these are oysters. Yes, they are. There's some oyster mushrooms, too. Wonderful. Awesome. We, I, I literally just shot the intro video like 40 yards ago. And to come and just find them, you know, this, this quick is pretty neat. Um, you know, gosh, I'll probably... These here, these ones look kind of small. This one here, I'm actually going to take this one with me. And I'm going to leave these ones here and I'm going to mark this on my map. And come back in a certain amount of days. I'm going to do some research, see how long it takes for them to mature. But, I'm going to find out. So, uh, you know, I'm just going to... Gosh, I should have brought my tripod for this. But I'm just going to cut this off right above my... There we go, that wasn't bad at all, was it? Left the mycelium. That is a very clean looking mushroom too. Very beautiful. Like I said, I've not found many of these and I think they are fantastic eating. So hopefully we'll find some more. Score. Get hey, let's get these mushrooms. Or let's get these oysters while we're at it, eh? Cut these guys off right at the thing there. Oh yeah, there we go. Ha. Hey. Hey, there's, oh yeah, well, there's bug got to that one right there, but that's all right. Here we go. Those definitely are oysters. You can tell by the smell. All right, well, let's keep on looking. Gosh, if we found some that fast, there's bound to be more, right? Found those last heresiums over there. Um, and it's been a while. Picked some oysters and some uh, aborted entolomas, but you can see right here, jackpot and time pays off you can see there's one two you know there's some other little guys here growing I don't know three four ten twenty but you can see there's some underneath there it's a nice one there and then on the back side here there's a couple more this one here is really nice this one here is probably the size of a well you know what these, these don't actually grow really, really that big. This one looks like one giant uh, comb tooth, but it's really not. If you look in here, this one's actually attached there, and there's another smaller one attached next to it. So they grow about the size of a softball, you know, roughly, I mean, up to that large. So we found this good score here. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick some more of these um, larger ones here, and those little tiny guys over there. I'm just gonna leave them like I did left those last ones to come back and check on them in a week. Here's some more oysters we picked. There's this other smaller heresium. And here's some of uh, those aborted entolomas I was telling you about. Those are another good fall mushroom. They're just starting to pop out of the ground over there, so they're gonna need some time to grow. You know, before I pick this one, I'm gonna get right up in here <clears throat> with this one. And you can see how how fine the, the teeth are in this thing. See that? And they're very, very, very delicate. I mean, you look at that. Um, people talk about lookalikes, and there are some that you could possibly mistake for them. I mean, not, to me, not really. You know, there are there are other ones like the like the bear's tooth and stuff that are they're also good edibles though. But they have a t kind of they're they're white. They have a 
instead of looking like this, it looks like hair almost falling down on them. Um, people say coral mushrooms. You know, coral mushrooms, you know, yeah, I guess so. You know, if you're not used to out being out picking. But, uh, yeah, anyway. There you go. Heresium corallites, also known as comb tooth mushroom. Another good mushroom to go out and get in the fall. They start, you know, I would say it's like I said, it's September 18th now. Anytime mid September through October, basically, is a good time to go find them. So, thanks for watching another one of my videos, everybody.